in a significant move forward in the march toward creating electronic circuits that are thousands of times smaller than today's most advanced technology, IBM is announcing a milestone in the ability to manipulate and understand matter at the atomic level. Scientists at IBM's Almaden Research Center in San Jose, California, have for the first time demonstrated the ability to measure exactly how much force is needed to move individual atoms. Knowing the different forces required to move different atoms will allow IBM's nano-constructionists to figure out which materials should be used for building devices from the atom up. For example, a so-called sticky atom would be used for something that you don't want to move, like a base that you want to keep in one place, while a so-called slippery atom would be used when you want to build something like an on-off switch that needs to move with ease. Ten or twenty years ago, nobody could imagine that we would have today laptops, cell phones, and iPods. I think it's impossible to speculate what nanoelectronics will bring us in ten or twenty years, but I'm sure it will change our world even more than, than the iPods we have today. The force is measured via tiny changes in the frequency of a small quartz tuning fork. This exploration of the realm of atomic scale structures and devices stands to impact the future direction of information technology. This is Jeff Gluck reporting.